Hello viewers, today we're going to do some hardware upgrades in this Dell Latitude D620. I'm not really sure what the difference is between the 620 and the 630. The cosmetics are pretty much the same as far as I can tell. It's got the, um, the light sensor there. I think that's the microphone so I don't know what the difference is anyways um, it's really in great condition so that's good uh, we're going to check and see how much memory is in there we'll check the uh, I think there's a slot under the keyboard and a slot under here I know the 630's maximum allocation is 4. I don't know if this one is 4 or 2. It's it's DDR2. So we're only going to be able to put in 2 because that's all that I have. I only have DDR2 and 1 gigabyte sticks. So I'll put one gigabyte stick in here, and we'll shut this. And before I start taking the keyboard out and everything, I want to look in the BIOS and see how much memory there is. It's possible that it already has a gigabyte in there. I don't know. It's branded as Window Vista capable, so it's quite possible that it did come with a full gigabyte. And uh, this particular Digitam Goodwill was good enough to include the hard drive caddy, which a lot of them do not, which is very agitating. But this one was good. We had a good piece of tape for covering up COAs. They even included the screws in old bag, although they're one short. Oh no, uh, yeah they are. Okay, so it's a, um, it's a SATA drive. So we'll go ahead and put one of these in there. This is a Samsung 256 solid state drive. I'm going to use the solid state because we're not working with a lot of memory. So having the SSD will be helpful. Because this way when it goes to page file, it's not going to just creep. Okay. Nice little bag for project screws. We'll hold on to that. It's got this foil on there for some reason. That may be an issue as I try to slide it in. Let's see what transpires. Okay, I guess it was non issue. Okay, drive is in. Let's go ahead and power this thing on and take a peep at the BIOS and see how much memory we have. Okay, so we have BIOS version of 2007, 1.6 GHz, and it is in fact 2048 MB, so it did have a single gigabyte inside of it. 
and I think this utilizes some of the RAM as video memory well it must because there's no way that it only runs off of 8 megabytes and oh no what the heck it is only taking 8 megabytes what in the world that's not correct should be taking more than that I don't know why in the world it's only taken 8 megabytes. Well, let's see if we can do a... Uh, just do a system reset here. Here we go. Okay, defaults have been loaded. It's still only pulling 8 megabytes for the video card. I don't understand why it's not going to run correctly that way. But that is what it's doing. Okay, well, I'm not sure why it's like that. We'll have to install the system and see what transpires. But we are good with the hardware upgrade and ready for the software install.